Hi, welcome to the Baltimore Metro Market Watch, brought to you by RBI, Real Estate Business Intelligence, an MRIS company. We're going to dig into the most recent numbers from the Baltimore Metro housing market, which includes the counties of Anne Arundel, Carroll, Baltimore, Harford, Howard, and the city of Baltimore. Let's jump right in. When we talk of a housing recovery, slow and steady is the name of the game. If there's one thing the last decade taught us, it's that bubbles don't last. For the most part, the story in 2011 should be continued stabilization early in the year, coupled with a gradual ascent in the latter half. With 2010 behind us, it's time to take a look at how our housing market began the new year. Pending sales increased 22% from last year to land at 1,981 for the month. There's generally a short lag time between when a property goes under contract and when it closes, which makes this a great indicator of purchase demand. Inventory increased slightly to 16,516 units. That's plenty of houses for buyers to choose from. Expect inventory levels to continue to grow as the spring market heats up, but we won't have the same number of first-time buyers turning out as we did last year. The house mix isn't just about techno beats and heavy bass. It also refers to the assortment of properties that are selling, and that affects prices. Prices slid somewhat in the Baltimore metro, which partly reflects increased activity at lower price points. The median sales price decreased 0.9% to $217,000. let us imagine that buyer's demand for homes is a sponge, absorbing the inventory from the housing market. The rate of that absorption is called the month's supply of inventory, and it currently sits at 8.3 months, up slightly from last year. A market with 5 to 6 months of supply is typically considered balanced. Mortgage interest rates are expected to remain around 5% while a number of important changes are occurring in the mortgage market. Although the Labor Department reported that the seasonally adjusted unemployment rate dropped to 9% in January, don't expect the unemployment issue to completely disappear anytime soon. It will prove to be a major factor driving home sales moving forward. That's the Baltimore Metro Market Watch for this month. Check back next month for the latest. 